video, I will be covering project roles and why it's important to assign them to your team. Plus, what to do if a team member logs time to a project without having a role. First, let's start by looking at the timesheet. Whenever someone has a role assigned to them within a project, we will display that role within the timesheet. As you can see here, my role for Prairie Drive project is project architect. But in the two projects below, it shows no assigned role. When your team sees this notice on their timesheet, they should notify an admin so that the admin can assign a role to them. But hey, things happen, it was late, it was Friday, and there was a deadline, they might have not notified you in time before submitting their timesheet. That's okay. As an admin, let me show you two steps you'll need to take to modify this. Step one is to go to the project, click edit, find the phase, and add a role. When you click on done, the person will now appear as part of your team. However, this will apply the rule moving forward in time only. You'll still need to address any time entries already made without a role. For instance, if we go into the report, you'll notice that the time entries I submitted still don't have a rate and that means they don't have a value. To adjust these entries already made, we'll need to go back into the timesheet to adjust historical information. Within the timesheets page, we've built a special tab for admins called Audit Timesheets. This is a page designed to help you scan for any errors or any information that might be missing on timesheets, such as role or activity. You can filter by project, or you can also filter by person. In this example, I want to update the hours entered to 180 Natoma, so I'll filter by project. This isolates the entries, and within the role dropdown, I'll see the roles that I have currently assigned to this project. I'll go ahead and select principal. When I refresh the project report, my 24 logged hours have now been properly updated and reflect a total of $6,000 in value, which had been applied to my project budget. If while on the audit page, you filter by a person's name instead of project, you might have noticed that other entries come up. You can adjust these by making sure that that person has a role within the project. Until they've been assigned a role, whenever you click here, it will appear empty. that They're not eligible for any roles within this project. We suggest visiting the audit page frequently to catch and prevent any potential errors on your project budget due to missing entries. Thanks for watching. I'm Eileen Mendoza, Director of Customer Success at Monograph, and I'm here to help.